So, went to the Lego shop recently and bought some goodies. Do you want to see what's inside these bags? Then stick around. Hi guys and welcome to the August Lego haul video and I've been to the Lego shop recently and bought some shiny new Lego uh, but before I get into what's in these bags I've got a couple of things I want to raise. Firstly I've hit my 250 sub mark. Yay! Thank you very much guys. It is much appreciated but what it does mean now is I can do my live draw for the giveaways part of that video. Now I'm going to be doing the live stream round about lunchtime is UK time on Saturday so there's still time for you guys to enter that competition. All you've got to do is head over to the video which I'm giving you a link to above, follow the instructions of that video and get yourself into that competition. Who knows you could actually win that Elton John custom minifigure. It's an absolutely amazing minifigure. And the second thing that I want to tell you guys is now I've hit my 250 sub mark, I'm going to be starting uh, a, another giveaway which will be the 500 sub mark. And what I've decided to do is, if you remember a few videos ago, I did a review of the July free gift which was the 12 in 1 rebuilding to set, which is this one. Um, obviously I didn't give it a very favourable review, but nonetheless I managed to get, grab myself a couple of these, obviously I used one to do the review. And I thought, well, why not give the second one away in a 500 sub giveaway? So, guys, watch out for that video. If you want to see the review of this, I'll leave a link above so you can go and check that out. But watch out for that video coming out soon. It'll probably be after I've done the 250 sub draw. But, uh, yeah, you could be winning this when I get to 500 subs. Keep an eye out. Subscribe to my channel. Hit that bell icon, and then you'll definitely, definitely get notified when I release the giveaway video for this set. Anyway, guys, I'm going to get on with doing the Lego haul now. Right then, guys, so let's get into showing you what's inside these bags. So I'm going to start with, which I'll start with, front or back. I'm going to start with the back bag, so this one. Now, in here, I've got an old set. And a new set so a set that I've been wanting for a while and it's not been released I think it was released last year maybe maybe even the year before I'd have to double check that and then one one set that's been released this year so I'm going to start with the set that's not been released this year and it is the Dino module set so I'm just going to bring it a bit closer to the camera for you guys and um, so I've been after this one for a while um, and it an opportunity came around recently so I thought I would purchase it. I absolutely love this set. Obviously you guys probably know that I'm a lover of the um, modular sets. This one is set number 10260. It's got 2480 pieces. I'm sure a lot of you guys are familiar with this one but yeah really really looking forward to to building this one and it will go along with my the rest of my modules and obviously towards the, the city that I eventually will build at some point. So that's that one. Now onto a set that was released this year, released in June this year I think it was, the certainly the last batch of stuff. And it is this little baby, which is the Harry Potter set, which is the uh, Attack on the Burrow. Absolutely love this, I love the colouring in the roof. This is set number 75980. Doesn't tell you how many pieces are on this one, but you guys have probably seen some of my videos, I absolutely love Harry Potter stuff. Um, you can probably see if I just move that, I've got a whole shelf full there of Harry Potter. Probably going to need to get another shelf at some point to um, to expand that collection. So that's bag number one down, that down there. And bag number two, before I get into the, the big set that's in here, um, this month's free gifts, a little bit disappointing to be honest. I've got two of each because we, both myself and my wife spent um, enough to get two sets of free gifts. So the first one I'm going to reveal, uh, and I'm sure you guys are probably fully aware of what these are, and probably as fed up as what I am at getting them as free gifts. I think Lego must have mass produced these because for some reason they seem to give these away every time you go in and buy something. Um, I think the I think the limit you had to spend was 35 to get this. I can't remember the limit for the rest of them, but let's not worry about that too much. 
So this is the wrapping paper and gift wrapping stuff. Um, so I think there's like stickers, a gift bag, wrapping paper, gift tags and cards. I personally don't use these, probably go into raffle prizes for the, the lug meets that I run. The next slightly less useless gift, but probably useless for me, and that is the pencil case. Now I'm sure those of you that have got children and obviously you're going in and buying your sets these will probably ideal especially when the kids get back going to school so me personally for me or my wife no use to them at all they're all right i mean you get a ruler a pencil a little notepad and obviously get the pencil case so you know for kids they're absolutely fantastic and i'm sure kids take these to school they'll probably be the envy of the class there's even a little rubber in there can't remember how much you need to spend for that but um I think that and the wrapping paper, they'll be raffle prizes. And then the last of the free gifts, which is slightly more useful, um, are the two friends poly bags, or the friends poly bags. And if I just hold that up a little bit close to the camera, you'll see what's in that. Now me personally, probably use these for parts, probably save one for a raffle and you know, do, do the, you build the other one, take a photo of it and then take it apart and use the parts. But at least it's Lego, that's the key thing. So, anyway. Well, I don't know what you guys think of these free gifts. Leave a comment below, let me know. And then the last of the August Lego haul, and unfortunately, I didn't buy this. My wife bought this. Um, but it is a pretty neat set. It's another one that was released this year. And that is, just pop that bag on the floor, the Mickey and Minnie Mouse set. Now, when that first came out, and I saw the reviews of it, I was like, hmm. It got a lot of negative press, actually. got a lot of negative comments within the sort of lug um, community. But then when I actually saw it in the display case at the Meadow Wall shop, it actually looked quite amazing. The, the figures themselves are a lot taller than you probably expect them to be. Uh, and my wife, being a massive Disney fan, fell in love with it straight away. I think it's like, like retail, retail, I think it cost £169.99. Um, that's pounds for those of you that are in the US. Whether it's worth it or not, I couldn't really say. I think my wife thinks it's worth it, otherwise she wouldn't have bought it. But guys, leave a comment, let me know. Do you think this is worth the money or not? I mean, I'm guessing some of you guys out there are probably Disney fans, so, but yeah, let me know. So yeah, that, that's it guys. That's the Lego haul for August. Not many sets, unfortunately. I'm trying to put them in. Hopefully you can see them, I that's going to fall off, put that there. Um, but we went for expensive rather than quantity, if, you know, if that makes sense. Let me know what you think to these sets. Do you like the Lego haul videos? I know it's quite popular on the YouTube community for, the, for those that like Lego. And obviously if you like my channel and like my videos, hit that subscribe button. Hit that like button for this video. Go check out my other videos as well. Uh, more importantly don't forget to hit that bell icon next to the subscribe button because if you don't you don't get notified when I release a new video you know so yeah just remember to click that bell icon when you hit that subscribe button as well so I'm going to sign off guys hope you enjoyed it catch you later and if you follow the instructions of that video you can um, if you follow the instructions for that video you can get yourself in if you follow yourself follow yourself <laughs> I'm <laughs> breathe. So if you follow the instructions, I'm gonna start that all over again. <laughs>